What's up guys, today we're gonna do a tutorial on how to do my velocity. All right, so we start with importing the clips. And now that I have imported my clip, I'm gonna um, import my music. I'm just gonna start with my POV clip. So I'm gonna import this to my um, composition. This is my comp settings. All right, so I'm gonna start with um, marking the, the beats. Hey, is that foreign? <laughs> So right here is beat you can also see it in like the so now that i have my, marked all my beats i'm gonna import my avi clip um i could also give you guys a tutorial if you want to on like how to do clips and stuff um this is a clip i made myself so yeah you can see that there hey is that for he said he had all right, so I want the shot to be here, so I, I can just name this shot if I want to. Um, hey, is that for? Then start my clip right here, like one frame back, like that. Then I'm gonna go to right when it's almost scoped in, like here, and press Control Alt T, right to bring up time remap. Then I'm gonna cut the clip and move this way. So now I'm gonna move this. Keep it one frame back and i'm gonna mark just where the, the scoping animation is beginning and get this to the marker like that so look like this hey is that for all right so now i have my other clip here i'm gonna go to like the last frame of the scoping set the marker here and then i'm gonna set another marker right before he um pull the pin thing is that for he said he so i'm gonna press f9 i'm gonna select the keyframes and press f9 so usually i i do it like i'm gonna here put this up and when this begins to scope right there this to turn off like i have two graphs so you can see if they like fit together you can do that by right clicking here and show reference graph hey is that for all right so now we have the first the first clip and the other clip i'm gonna do like a bit different normally many people just do um like this or something i don't I, I really don't want that i don't think that looks any good so i'm gonna pull this up and then this like that he said he hey is that for he said he hey, hey. all right that's my velocity um now i can add some clips if i want to like a cinematic all right so now that i have imported my cinematic i'm gonna drag it to here Hey, is that for right there? I'm gonna press Ctrl Alt T, drag out the markers. Okay, so now I'm gonna see where I, where the, I want to end it right here. I'm gonna make a keyframe that and set it to the um the the not the last frame, the frame before the last frame. All right, <clears throat> I'm gonna pull this out. Pull this up. Hey, is that for? Hey, is that for? Maybe it's too. I don't. Maybe it should be like a little more linear. Hey, is that for? Hey, is that for? All right, so that's actually my velocity. Hey, is that for? Um. Now I'm gonna add some effects. And I will see you later. So now I'm gonna add my CC. Um, I record my clips in like a grayscale thing, so I can do a better um, CC. So I'm gonna add a lot of contrast to my clips. You can see. So now I'm gonna uh, play it through with the effects and stuff. Hey, is that for? He said he. So that's how I do my velocity. Thank you guys so much for watching. This was my velocity um, tutorial. It was pretty short. Um, but
but I hope I got the point across and you guys can use this in your own edits if you want to. Um, yeah, see you guys.